Hello everybody, Stuart here from Stubio Gaming. Today I'm going to be playing Inquisitor Marta again. Um, hopefully the audio will work this time because the audio did actually fail last time for some strange reason. Um, my headset didn't seem to uh, work. Um, who knows why, anyway. Um, I'm actually going to be uh, joined by one of my friends for my gameplay today, so um, I will... Uh, Hopefully get him in-game in a few minutes, and uh, we'll carry on from there, so uh, I'll see you in a few minutes. Yeah. Right, well, I'm going to do a an intel myself. I just need to sell some stuff. Um, we will be having, in the update, we will be having a new type of Void Crusade as well. Um... No. Yeah, I think the car car ones are going to be quite a way off because then they hadn't even planned it. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Well, this will be an interesting uh, mission for us. It's got 80% physical damage bonus for enemies, one champion extra in each group, 50% HP for ranged enemies and one ranged enemy in each group, 30% damage bonus for elite, 30% damage bonus for champion, 30% damage bonus for villain and commanders, 30% damage bonus and 25% movement speed for horde. Yep. Let me know when you're ready. Yeah. The very existence of this filth defiles the Imperium. They may be great in numbers, but if we sever the head, the body will die. Kill their leaders and break their will. Yeah, 300% extra damage. But... Yeah. Is that a, um, did you say it was a Psalm Doctrine? Yeah, they need to give them names. They they don't have names. They haven't no, they haven't given them names, which I think is really stupid. Because you could you could actually have a build around a doctrine and then you could name your build the doctrine name. So the one that I'm using I've I have called the Flechette Doctrine. Because it, it it kind of splits everything into multiple parts, which is just like a flechette round. So The one that uh, now works on my uh, rocket pack as well. Yeah. All that. Really? Yeah, but the whole point is, if you're face tanking something, you're going to be so close that you're hitting with all three rounds. And although it halves the damage, you triple the shot, so you're actually getting a damage increase. So if I shoot that, I mean, they melt really quickly. And if I shoot all of my rockets, and also because I heal on criticals, um, the extra rounds really do help. But I'm trying to find a weapon, well not necessarily a weapon, just something that says um, 
heal for every hit or something like that. Even if it's a lowish amount. Yeah, and it's not just that, it also means that if I go into a mission that says you don't get criticals, it doesn't matter. Because at the moment, if I go into a mission that says you don't get criticals, it's a real slog. I mean, the last one wasn't too bad, because obviously I do a fair amount of damage now. Um... We've taken one out already. My oh, God. Where was it? Nice. Yeah. I want to hit the next one with my rocket pack, see what it does to it. Right, here it is. Dead. <laughs> oh dear, that was quite funny. Because of course... No. Was that enough numbers? You set a fine example for their kind, Inquisitor. Yeah. <laughs> Exterminatus build. <laughs> There's a reliquary up here. Okay guys, let's see what I found, um, hopefully I'll get something good, ooh, red power hammer, architect, uh -oh. well that's a bit rubbish, shock aura for two seconds, sell this stuff, um, actually I'll sell the power hammer as well because I don't need it, set to myself, the meme virus. There we go. Stuff the rest in my stash and then I will call this video an end. Actually I'll sell 20 intel as well. Get me some cash. There we go. Right. Okay. That's it for this video guys. Uh, I hope you have enjoyed it. If you have, please make sure you click the like button. Subscribe if you are new to the channel. And when you do subscribe, click the bell icon so you're notified when I upload next. And please do leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Um, I think you could tell from the experience gained that uh, definitely get more in multiplayer. But uh, let me know your experiences and uh, any builds that you're currently running. Well, thank you very much for watching, guys. I really appreciate it and look forward to seeing you for my next video very soon. You all take care. Bye for now.